What's good YouTube? Today we're going to talk about a tech card. Haven't done this in a while. And uh, I wanted to highlight my body as a shield for the upcoming format. A lot of you guys know that it's coming. A lot of you guys have been paying attention to the OCG and known that it's seen play here. But I want to talk specifically about the things that it can stop and what it's going to do for you moving forward. This quick play is actually insane. When your opponent activates a spell or trap card or a monster effect that would destroy a monster or monsters on the field, except during the damage that pay 1500 life points, negate the activation if you do destroy it. So, destruction effects are going to be very common. Uh, the main goal, again, of this next format, very, very, very similar to the last format, is going to be build your board and kind of protect it. And My Body as a Shield allows you to play decks like Pure Zodiacs without, you know, cards like Siegfried or Harbinger that are protecting your board. And cards like Dark Hole and uh, Regeki are going to see a lot of play. And these two cards... First off, Japan only has one Dark Hole, and they have no Regeki. So these cards are going to be much, much more impactful in the format. We've been seeing them in the Zodiac tournament uh, that has up to win, which is legal. And a lot of these field spells are getting played. A lot of them are seeing play. And we've actually seen my body in a couple of feature matches already, too. Uh, actually, two of them, I believe, out of four. So my body is a shield. is going to help you like have your uh, Dryden up. It's going to help you have your reactives up in monster form and kind of protect them from anything but kaijus. But with the kaiju engine, it'll actually stuff kaiju slumber too. Destroy as many monsters on the field as possible. First line of text, does it destroy a monster on the field? Yep, my body as a shield will stop it. Now to note, it won't protect a monster that's being already been destroyed and sent to the graveyard and is activating its effect and then gets negated or something like that. So you do have to like consider where you're using it. It's always protecting a monster on the field. Field, but it will stop anything. It will negate and destroy anything uh, destroying a monster on the field, such as Zodiac Dryden itself. If Dryden is targeting a face up monster that you've overlain with, you just negate and destroy it. That's pretty cool. Like, as a quick play, my body has so many applications during your own turn as well as there. If you draw it going first, you can build your board and protect it. If you draw it going second, you can protect your monsters that you're starting to put out on the field. From other cards, such as Ghost Ogre as well. Ghost Ogre, if it goes for the monster, my body is going to intercept and hit it out of the, basically, I, I'm sorry, I can just imagine, like, Marauding Captain taking hits from, like, Ghost Ogre going like this on his back. It's just crazy. So, we definitely will see a lot of play from my body as the shield basically in this format and another huge note is that uh the wind witches are going to be making a uh, crystal wing that's protected and can't be destroyed by card effects but the thing is my body as a shield will still negate the crystal wing so even though it's not going to go to the graveyard here it's still going to get negated so that if you're building your board with your monsters it's going to be able to completely stuff its effect of negating your monsters because it's going to negate that effect because that effect's also going to try to destroy the monsters. Some other important interactions that you might be able to see during the format will be, uh, well, this one's not going to be that common, but Reflasia sending bottomless trap hole or treacherous.